Uh, another detail which is special about Exos is uh, because we, we are keen racing sailors ourselves, uh, we know the importance of not only the weight and the stiffness and all these things we've been talking about, but also the accuracy of the keel sections. When we uh, have a boat we set up for racing, we always put templates on the keel to see whether the section is absolutely correct because these keel sections are actually developed many years ago, most of them by uh, the American aerospace industry. It is extremely important that we get the detail, uh, the accuracy perfect to have an optimum lift. Uh, when we go upwind, we have the keel uh, to give lift and also to minimize the resistance. So uh, in the old days, the first many years, 20 years of our history, we used templates and we fared the keels and that means the, the cast iron keel and lead keel uh, came home, bolted together, and uh, then we, they were slightly too small, then we added fiberglass around them, and then we, uh, we fared with uh, plastic padding or epoxy filler, and that took many days actually. Uh, we could spend up to 60, 70 hours to make a, a nice surface. And our clients, when they buy an Exot, they pay a premium price, they expect also the keel to be uh, in perfect shape. A lot of our clients are, uh, most of them are, let's say, around my age, or a lot of them are my age, but they're former, maybe world champion sailors, they know all the details, how important it is, so they check the templates, uh, see how accurate we built the boat, some of them. So we develop a technology where we actually encapsulate the metal keel in, in a, a epoxy shell. So this shell is actually two half molds. Uh, they are having the perfect shape. It's a very stiff, very strong mold, uh, which we have five axis machine the block to a fraction of a millimeter accuracy. And then the keels comes home, as I explained before, slightly too small, two millimeter, three millimeter, four millimeter, smaller than the final surface. And then we uh, just encapsulate them into this, uh, this uh, fiberglass shell or epoxy shell. Um, and uh, as far as I know, we're the only yard in the world doing this, uh, this thing.